Welcome back to the show, kids. Oh, no. Okay, it's video of the week time. This one's a really cool one. Um, this is a preacher who is not only filled with the Spirit of the Lord, but he's filled with something else. Check it out. Pan. Woo! How about made in heaven? Hallelujah. I had religion, but I didn't have Jesus. Yeah. I, didn't have a <laughs> I didn't have a whole lot of religion. Thank God. Some people have a whole lot of religion. And that religion ain't going to get you to heaven. Religion, I mean, there's different definitions for religion. One is a good one. But one is just religion, in which is really uh, church entity, God, uh, man-made, and not God-made. Some folks are man-made. That's a powerful truth, isn't it? That's good. You folks out there that love this other, some of these things that come out of my mouth by the Spirit of God. Some folks are man-made. There's some man-made preachers out there. I probably had a little bit of man-made. Still may have a little. I don't know. But years ago, I probably had a little more than I do now. I've been through so many fires and trials that I don't know how much is man-made or Bob-made, but I will say this, Christianity, being a child of God, can only be God-made. God-made. Amen. Mm-mm-mm. Lord. You know, that preacher in, uh, in real life uh, actually had an office out of Tulsa and was responsible for ripping a bunch of people off. Check him out. Tilton's the last name. Check him out on uh, Wikipedia. Okay, uh, Tom's got another batch of uh, events that you got to know about, so time it, boy. Well, here we are in my office again at The Current. Uh, I feel comfortable, although I did have fun, like I said last week. Uh, here's a name, Jeff Goebel. Why did that? Oh, George Goebel. George Goebel is an old actor, kind of like in the old days, George Goebel was a comedian. Anyway, Jeff Goebel is going to be at Jasper Saddle Club on Thursday, uh, actually on Wednesday this week. Uh, and it's, you know, if, it's, if you're watching and it's already past Wednesday, you missed him. Uh, and that's just, the reason I brought that up is also on Wednesday at the cane break, it's going to be Klondike 5. Klondike 5. Klondike 5 is one of those jamming bluegrass bands that I happened to see at the Harvest Festival over in uh, Fayetteville, over in Arkansas, Ozark, Arkansas, to be a matter of fact. That's just great. They're just one of those bands that's original, and you just can't ever tell what they're doing. Um, so that's, that's on Wednesday. Uh, and I already mentioned earlier in the show, but don't forget that on Friday, uh, Junior Brown's going to be up in Miami. But this is uh, Telequah. We're in the Qua. And in, uh, at uh, Brew Dogs is going to be a band called Shades of Red. Now, I'm not sure who Shades of Red is, but I sure had a good time there last week uh, at, at Brew Dogs for the, uh, is it, was it Babies for Babies or Babies for Babies? Babies for Babies. Babies for Babies. Or it could be Babies for Babies. Anyway, okay, it was a good time. It was a good show. Anyway, Brew Dogs has Shades of Red coming up uh, on Friday. And then uh, at Scooters is going to be Locus. And Locust is that happening new band that everybody is talking about. So go over to Scooters on Friday night and see Locust. And then if you want to take a break, go out, you can you know, run down or drive down to Brew Dogs and drive back. But you always want to get back. Sorry, Mike, but you want to get back to Scooters for Locust. Um, let me see if you, you know, and also since we're talking about the Qua, at the college end of town, which is what I've been starting to call it. I don't care what anybody else calls north it. North End. The North the End. North end. The, north end. the North End of the college in a town in the North End. The Redmond, North end. district. The Redmond district. Who cares? We've always got the crowbar now to talk about. And you know, I've been trying to find a phone number for them, and they're so new. I, I called the owner's number, but his it's, it's, it's message box is full. Hmm. It's really hot. He's a busy guy. Josh is a busy guy. But somebody did something right here in town. So right there at the uh, across from the, the park. Uh, next to the karate shop on the other side of the, the Indian Art Gallery, uh, not far from Salmonella's, is the crowbar. And uh, they'll have somebody good playing. Oh uh, man, last week, J Jeremy was there. Yeah, Josh uh, will be on the show next week. Josh will be on the show next week. There you go. Josh will be on the show next week. Anyway, they'll have somebody good there this weekend. And by the way, they're open seven days a week. This is a new thing, too. Two to two. <laughs> two to two, seven days a week. 
Um, alrighty. Anyway, and then also I want to mention Roxy's is back open. So now we got lots to, and you know, Granny's Attic is open. I mean, there's a lot happening here in town. But don't forget about Locus over at Scooters. Um, and then also on Saturday night at the Brew, Brew Dogs is going to be, um, it says the Sean, Ada, Sean Adair Band. So I'm not sure who Sean Adair is. Uh, it's not Sean Adair, that sounds like a girl's name. This is Sean Adair Band on Saturday night. And don't forget uh, that uh, Susan Herndon, Sunday, I'm mentioning this, Sunday, Susan Herndon, Susan Herndon, our sweet Susan Herndon, Herndon is going to be at the Grape Ranch. Susan Herndon. Susan Herndon is with the Grape Ranch. Check the current out for other things going on. Lots happening. See you around the North End, the Redmond District, the College of Town, whatever it is. See you around the Gua. Okay, folks, before we cut out to commercial, I just want to remind you that if you need to shoot me out an email, you can reach me at jscott at intv.me. Send me some love mail, hate mail, in between mail, you know. Pictures of your girlfriend naked. No, I'm kidding. Don't do that. No, do that. Okay, folks, when we come back, Dean Williams, local boys, local boys, pretty good. Mikey B over there was, yes, 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 quite, <laughs> was responsible for uh, helping them uh, put that show together. So when we come back, Dean Williams, folks, yo, 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 yo. yo. yo.